We recently told you about Monroe Biotechnology and how it is helping victims of the earthquake in Haiti. Well, this morning, Angela Kelly is getting a tour of the Green Bay Company, and she joins us now live. Hi, Angela. Hey, good morning, Pete and Rachel. Well, this is uh, how many um, prosthetic limbs that Monroe Biotechnology in Green Bay has uh, collected so far. This is just a few of them. And what they're going to do is deconstruct the parts uh, so they can re be remade into new ones for those who need them in Haiti. But as we all know, uh, there are people uh, right here in our area who need artificial limbs, and they are made right here in this lab that we're standing in. Ken Eveley is a physical therapist and the owner of Monroe Biotechnology. Good morning. Good morning, Angela. So you're going to take us through the process, and we start with this? We are. We take a very accurate cast of someone's limb. This would be for someone who lost their limb right about here. And then eventually we come up with a model that looks like the one they're working on right now. That model is then has plastic heat formed over it and then vacuum applied to it. Okay, and so eventually, um, it's when it gets vacuumed, it's about exactly. right here. And then eventually, we're looking at something like this. Exactly. Okay, so once, where do we go from here? Well, once we, once we take this, we'll take this and we'll fit this onto the patient. We're, we're able to see how, the, how, the, how his limb fits into here. We walk them in this, and then through our, our, our dynamic trial process, we have them leave the office and walk in this, come back in a week or so, and make whatever changes we have to make. Eventually, w once it's fitting perfectly well, we take it and transform it into a finished prosthesis that looks like this. And you can, I mean, the detail is really incredibly, uh, you know, like unique, and, and it's incredible. I mean, the color of the toenails even, you can mm -hmm. really match it to somebody's actual limb. We can. In this, in this case, we took an impression of the, of the person's elder leg and did everything we could to match the color, the contour, the style, the toenails, the nail beds, everything. How long does so. it take to make something like this? From the time of the surgery to the finished product is anywhere from four to six months, typically. And definitely a life-changing process for many people. It's very satisfying. Yeah. It's very we're, satisfying. We're actually going to meet some of uh, Monroe Biotechnology's patients, uh, people who've actually lost their limbs and are, and are using prosthetics to, um, you know, get their lives uh, back on track again. If you're interested in uh, donating for um, the, the drive for the Haiti, can people just call here right at the office? You bet. Call us either here or in Appleton, and we'll find a way to get those devices. Okay. Thanks, Ken. Good. We'll toss Thank it back you. to you guys. Okay. Thanks, Thanks Angela. Thanks,